In this video, I will show you how to pair your phone emulator with a watch emulator. There are two ways that you can pair your virtual device to your watch emulator, manually or using the Wear OS Simulator Pairing Assistant. For this video, we will use the Pairing Assistant. Before we begin, there are a couple of requirements for our emulators. To use the Wear OS Simulator Pairing Assistant, your phone must be running Android 11, API level 30, or higher, and have Google Play Store installed. The watch emulator must be running the API level 28 or higher. If your current virtual devices don't meet these requirements, go watch this video where I show you how to create new virtual devices with a detailed explanation of how to choose the right API level and Android versions. Now, you just need to click those three dots and select Pair Wearable to launch the Pairing Assistant. If it is disabled, like it is the case here, that means this device doesn't meet the requirements mentioned earlier. Now, since we have launched the Pairing Assistant from a phone, it will show us a list of available Wear OS devices. If we had started with a watch emulator, it would have shown a list of eligible phones or tablets to pair with. Those virtual devices are unavailable because they don't meet the requirements mentioned earlier. Let's select the device that we want to pair and click Next. The Assistant will first start the phone emulator and then the watch emulator. This may take a few minutes. Depending on your emulator system image, you might need to first update your Google Play services before you can pair the devices. If this is your first time opening the Play Store app, you will need to go through the setup process and log in with your email. Now the Google Play services is up to date. We can come here and click Restart Pairing. Select your device again, then click Next. The WebOS Companion app is required to pair devices. And since our phone emulator doesn't have it, we will come here and click this button to open the Play Store and install it. If the Companion app is already installed on your emulator, the Pairing Assistant will skip this step. With the installation complete, open the Companion app, click Next, then start setup and accept the terms and conditions. Once you're on that screen, you can go to the top right corner, click on the three dots and select pair with emulator. After a while, you will see the screen saying that the pairing was successful. Click finish, then you should see an icon like this one next to both the watch and the phone in the device manager. To ensure seamless communication between the watch and the phone, complete the setup in the companion app and allow necessary permissions, such as running the app in the background and enabling watch notifications. As a quick demo, let's use the emulator's extended control to send this SMS to the phone. As you can see, we can visualize the message on the watch and even respond to it from the watch. If you ever need to unpair the devices, click the three dots, select View Paired Devices, and click the minus icon to unpair. And that's how you effortlessly pair phone and watch emulators. If you found this tutorial helpful, please give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more.